Nice. And not anymore. I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, don't even think about getting out. Those will work. Oh, smoke. I'm out. We've got enemy reinforcements. Recommend me a good movie, Toby. Oh, yeah. Where would I fucking... Yeah, hang on. I've just got to kill a couple dudes. Yeah, so a good movie would be Hush. The Invitation, if you've got Netflix. Uh, the Invitation is probably one of the best Hush. thrillers I've seen. Oh. No, I it is. I really want to see that movie with the blind guy in it. Now that is a clip, ladies and gentlemen. That is a clip. Recommending a movie for Will and getting a few kills. Hey, get out of here because this guy's got nades and I'm a fucking dude. He mellowed me! Oh, what a... Oh, oh, I was doing alright. G'day gamers, what do you think of that clip? That was uh, with Emma Will last night. Ask me about movies while playing Gears of War 3. I mean, hell. I've got heaps of Gears of War 3 clips and videos. I might do a jumble bit together, but I haven't had much time to edit. But look, before I get into it, another newbie unboxing of the Gears of War 4 console. I went and picked up from EB Games today. Traded it in the old Xbox One, Day 1 edition. And can I just tell you peeps, I got a good deal with this. Now, I'm pretty sure you've seen heaps of other unboxing videos done by SA Shadows and everybody else, but they were professionals and they used cameras. I'm using a GoPro at the end of my bed. I've got the dog, if you can't see. I don't know how it's going to turn up. I've got a dodgy knife. I've just come straight from work in the shop. I've got dodgy shorts. So here's another noobish dodgy, unbo dodgy unboxing. <laughs> I'm so excited, peeps. Like, check this out. Like, man, look, they've gone out all nuts. We're not, you know, as gearheads, we're a bit used to it, but this is just insane. Look at that. I'm not even going to throw this away. I mean, it's, it's so simple, but so damn good. Such a nice touch. And the inside, the, look at that. Ooh. Like, in, look at that. That's just the artwork. I mean, oh man, that's, I'm serious, peeps. It's so good. I've got a really good trade in. Got a good deal. That's a HDMI cable. We've all seen that. Um, what's this did bit here? This is the power cord because there's no power brick. We're not used to that as Xbox players. And here we go. This is the bit I'm kind of looking forward to. This controller is meant to be pretty good. Now, I deliberately haven't seen some of these videos to look at these controllers because I'm super excited. Oh, Duracell batteries. Check it out. That is... That's... That's, um... Excuse my French. Fucking sexy as. Right, so... That... Pretty much straight to the point. Here we go. Now, the bit we've all been waiting for. Now, this is the game with the code and everything. Yeah, so it's got the code. It's got the backboard. So, it comes with the... Uh, what is it? Ultimate Edition. So you get the game, you get the season pass. Uh, EB Games gave me some more codes. Did you do get that? I'm, and they did tell me they got a whole back a t-shirt for me. I'm pretty happy with that, actually. I'm pretty happy with that. Normally, you know, people say you get the console cheap here and there, but EB Games look after you if you've been a good customer, which I have been for a while. So, look inside the box. Like, if you can see from there. How cool is that, man? That's just fucking just, just insane. That's just, oh, man, I can't wait to... It's probably going to take four days to download, but I can't wait here in Australia, but I can't wait to play this game, man. I really, really can't. And look, here we go. Just unboxing all this stuff. Oh, man. I mean, look at that, Ruckus. That's my dog, by the way. That is... Look at... You've got the cog. You've got Crimson Omen. You've got... I just, I'm lots of words, peeps. I'm over the moon. It's, it's, you got USB at the front, you got two USBs at the back, HDMI in and out, you got the LAN, you've got uh, optical in, you've got the uh, optical out, all that stuff, the power cable. This is what should have happened at launch, Xbox. This should have been the original Xbox One, but anyway, people, it's nowhere near as heavy 
or as <clears throat> a brick as the last one. Look at that. Well, I don't know if it makes any funny noises or not, but look, look at that. It's just sexy as. So, just a very quick, very noobish unboxing, people, of the Gears of War 4 console controller. I've just woken up my dog. Look, I'm not going to show you the first 20 minutes of it. You've all seen it. I'm not going to show you any of the campaign. I'm not, people, because I'm just going to pay the crap out of this tomorrow. And uh, I'm going to give you my thoughts about it later on. The campaign, I like to leave that up to my view, you know, my, my small subs here, because they'll work it out themselves. I don't want to ruin it. I'm going to show you the first gameplay, because the thing that's all in our minds is, is that SMG really OP as fuck? And if it is, well, we'll just see how it goes. Is it in the Gears of War 3? Depends how Gears of War 4 multiplayer is. This game looks fantastic. I do have an old TV. One day I might upgrade to another TV, but at the moment I'm very, very happy with the console this purchase. So, Frank and Tab, be good to those that own you. Sorry there's been a lackluster of videos. It's been incredibly busy the last couple of weeks. And uh, what can going to say? I'll catch you in my face on the battlefield, I guess. That's it. That's it. As I come around to the other end of the bed and just go, wow, I'm an ugly motherfucker. Catches.